Women, do you ever do this when you're in an argument with a man, you just stop talking? One day, she was ignoring me and she ignored me for four hours. So I thought, good time to make a joke. I walk up to her, I'm like, babe, hey, I'm thinking of going to Amazon and ordering a hot water bag. She like, why? For your cold shoulder. <laughs> I bought an ice pack for my black eye. <laughs> so I started dating. And I remember my friends, they would walk up to my girlfriend and they would be like, Oh my God, you're dating a comedian. He must be funny all the time, no? And she's like, yeah, every time. And they're like, yeah, every time. He's like, you know, jokes. And you're like, <laughs> He's like, jokes. And you're like, <laughs> He's like, jokes. And you're like, oh, stop it. And it's a funeral. <laughs> And trust me guys, I am the best person to date because I am funny all the time. The only difference, y'all get the good jokes. <laughs> she has heard some of the most rejected, bakwas jokes I have come up with in my... You want to know a great example? One day she came home, she came home from a jog, she was sweating, top to bottom, non-stop sweating. I looked at her and I'm like, hey, why are you sweating? What are you? Al Pacino. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she didn't talk to me for a few months. But to give her credit, she's also very funny. She's very funny. She's funny in the, you know, I'm going to crack a mean joke and Sile's a comedian so he can take it, but he cries internally type funny. I'll give you a great example. One day we were walking and I was holding her hands and I'm like, babe, your hands are so small. And she's like, yeah, it makes your penis look bigger. <laughs> the worst moment, man, the worst moment. She was so mean to me. You know what a birthday suit is? A uh, birthday suit? <laughs> Birthday suit is when you remove all your clothes and you're completely naked, right? So many years ago, Valentine's Day, I'm like, I'll surprise her. And I said, come home, I've got a surprise for you. When she came home, I had removed all my clothes and I was just standing like this. <laughs> and I'm like, hey, what do you think of my birthday suit? She looked at me from top to bottom and said, it means alteration. <laughs> I also give it back to her. I also give it back to her. I'll tell you why, okay? Like, women, do you ever do this when you're in an argument with a man, you just stop talking? <laughs> right? I love it. Ultimate power. Because your lack of communication breaks our mind. <laughs> like, mid-fight, yeah, yeah, yeah. You stop talking, the man suddenly like, ah. <laughs> but what? Why? No, hello, hi. And then I put, oh, yeah, so, ah. Say something, please. <laughs> One day, she was ignoring me and she ignored me for four hours. Now, any sane person would immediately apologize. But I'm a comedian, right? So I thought, good time to make a joke. I walk up to her, I'm like, babe, Hey, I'm thinking of going to Amazon and ordering a hot water bag. She like, why? For your cold shoulder. <laughs> I bought an ice pack for my black eye. <laughs> and it's tough, man. It's really tough, right? Like, you say things as a, like you say things, it just comes out of your mouth and then your mind is like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> right? And it happens. You want to know a fantastic example, right? One day she's like, hey, I'm thinking Friday night, uh, if your parents are not in town, I'm gonna come and spend some time at your place. And I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna have some fun time. And she's like, yeah, just letting you know I'm on my periods. Oh. <laughs> What do you mean by, oh? 
are you trying to imply that I am nothing but an object for you to use <laughs> and throw away that apart from sex, there is nothing that our relationship can provide. We can't spend time with each other. Like, we can't just Netflix. It has to be the chill part also. Is, is that what it is? Like, what am I? What am I? Look at me. What am I? I'm a pound of flesh. Is that what I am? Am I a pound of flesh to you, Shylock? Is that what I am? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Talk to me. Talk to me and give me an answer as to why did you say, oh. Aap jis number se call karna chaate ho? Uplad hai. We don't know how to fight, yaar. Men are, men are idiots, dude. For us, fighting in a relationship is like, you know that game, Minesweeper? <laughs> right? It's exactly like that. We are just randomly pressing buttons going, please don't explode. Please, please, please. Please don't explode. And we will say sorry, but we'll also say sorry so badly, we'll say anything that comes to our mind, right? The sweetest ever words. Sorry, Janu, Bebu, Shonu, Junnu, Munnu, Raju, whatever, whatever. <laughs> My advice to all the men tonight, I would suggest as soon as the show is done, please, and anyone who's watching, go home or wherever you are, please go to Amazon and buy yourself a shovel. <laughs> So you can dig your own grave <laughs> at any point of time because it is going to happen. You want to know an example? A few months ago, we were talking and she's like, hey, what do you plan to do in the evening? Oh, nothing. I'm planning on hanging out with my brother. Oh, your brother who's back from London? Cool. When were you going to tell me about him? <laughs> I thought I told you, right? Remember that day we were talking for two hours and then in the middle I was like, yeah, my brother's back from London and then I was like, we just talking, chit-chatting. No, 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 no. <laughs> you called me Al Pacino. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen, listen. This was an important thing, okay? Why, why didn't you want to, right? Like, why? Why didn't you share it with me? <laughs> okay. Listen, listen to me, okay? I'm, I'm truly sorry, okay? Baby, sweetie, Shona. I, 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 I beg of you. Listen, listen, don't be mad. Please, trust me. Trust, honest mistake, I, I really didn't think it was important enough to tell people. <laughs> I was buried in my grave. There was a tombstone there saying, Here lies Sahil Shah. Famous last words, Baby, I think you're overreacting. <laughs> Hi there, I really hoped you enjoyed that video and you thoroughly laughed at my pain. Now before you go, I would really appreciate it if you press the subscribe button I'm going to be releasing a ton of stand-up videos this year and I would love for you to be part of that journey with me. So press subscribe, do it, do it now. And also press the like button and leave a positive comment below for the algorithm. So more people get to know that, hey, Sahil Shah is in his grave. Let's find out why. Last but not the least, I'm going to be touring India as well as international this year. So if you want to buy tickets for any of my upcoming shows, I'm leaving a link in the description. It's below. You can click it, see tickets for my upcoming shows, as well as join a mailing list for future show updates. Yeah, that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, I shall see you next time. Uh, I need to just, yeah, I need to go back to digging my grave. I'll see you. And I'm coming. <laughs>